Welcome to the NASDAQ Market Site. I'm Jill Malandrino, global markets reporter at NASDAQ. Joining me on set, we have Anthony Millen. He's a partner at Shulman Rogers and the chair of Next, and we're here to focus on paving the way to success for startups. Anthony, it's great to have you, Thank you on for set me. with us. And startups, they are really dependent on legal services. It can run an average of 77000 per year, um, according to Cruise Consulting. What kind of services do startups typically require? So when you first start a company, one of the first things you need to do is you need to get an entity set up, whether you're going to be an LLC or a C-Corp and where to set up that entity. Then you have a name for the company and for your product or service. And so you need to protect that name. So you work with an attorney to protect that. You want to start talking to other people about your new great idea. And so you want some sort of confidentiality protection as you start sharing your idea with other people. And then as you move a little bit further along, you're ready to bring on an advisory board and independent contractors and consultants and employees. That triggers a range of legal needs that you need to deal with. And then you want to incentivize these advisors and consultants and employees. So you need an equity incentive plan. And then during that first year, you also want to raise capital. So you would go out and raise some seed stage financing capital. So all of those are types of legal needs that a startup would have early on. That's it? <laughs> so how does, how does Next address all these issues and help these startups? Yeah. So Next is a completely new model for delivering legal services to startup and emerging growth companies. It's a very unique and customer-centric model. And what we've done with Next is really try to solve the three main problems that entrepreneurs experience in consuming legal services. The first is predictability and um, sustainability. So when you're an entrepreneur, you're managing a P&L, you have great insight into many areas of your P&L, but legal is just one of those line items in a P&L that's just very unpredictable and can really range from X to 5X of what you budgeted for. And also as you start growing and legal costs get more and more um, expensive, it becomes very difficult to sustain. So at Next, the way we've dealt with that is we've taken a broad range of legal services and we have broken them down and constructed them into legal packages, into fixed price packages of legal services. And it covers a broad range of areas from formation and financing to immigration, employment, intellectual property. So you get that predictability. And we have even gone further and constructed certain packages into specific bundles that are very targeted to needs of startups in their earliest stage. It sounds like this is very different than what the typical legal firm would offer. Yes, uh, in, in, a couple of, in, in a couple of areas. The first is most law firms will deliver legal services still through a very unpredictable, very expensive billable hour model. The second area is that a lot of times when you're working with law firms, particularly the larger law firms as an early stage startup, you're just not getting um, to have direct access on a consistent basis to the senior partners who have the most experience. And it's during this early stage that you're making these really critical decisions and having access to senior attorneys. So that's another element of what we do with Next is that built into these packages is direct time and access to senior attorneys. So those are kind of two big differences. Well, can you tell us a little bit about your experience and how it influenced what you're doing with Next? Yes, so my background, um, I, in addition to working with startup and emerging growth companies as an attorney, which is what I exclusively focus on, I've been an entrepreneur. So I've co-founded several companies that I've built and run. And so I have spent a lot of time as a consumer of legal services on the other side of the table. And it was, in those experiences that these, these challenges um, I got to face that uh, customers and clients are facing now that we're solving with Next. All right, well that's valuable to clearly be able to anticipate what their concerns are. Now, how does NASDAQ fit into the bigger picture with Next? So NASDAQ and Next partnership is, is really important in the Next platform and that's kind of the third big area of the Next program and that's technology. Um, a lot of times, you do not, there's all this great technology and it's just not incorporated into the model of delivering legal services. And that's where, that's where NASDAQ Board Vantage comes in. So what we've done is we combined a set of services all around due diligence, 
um, room management, document management, um, the ability to manage your corporate board meetings, your shareholder meetings, your corporate minute books, task management, all of these great features that NASDAQ Board Vantage has when combined with our legal operation services provides the solution that is very collaborative, very interactive, and very, very efficient. And we looked around and were so impressed with the NASDAQ um, platform in how secure it was, in how intuitive it was, and how scalable and how secure. And well, where can we find more information on you and the NEXT program? So the best place to go is to go to our website, www.next.law. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us at MarketSite. Thank you.